Hey y'all, Decamon here, and welcome back to Control. We are back in the Ritual Division because shit's going down! Woohoohoo! Right off the- oh god. Rank 5, right off the bat. Oh, good sir! Good sir, you have to do better than that! Yeah, <laughs> right in the face. Oh uh, yeah, I figured I had a bureau alert before I logged off last time, and now it's time to clean house! Oh, your shield is gone, good sir! That shield is gone. And I keep shooting you in the frickin' legs. Well, you don't like getting shot in the face or anywhere else, do you? That's two key hiss targets. Should be one more. Is there one more? Where are you, one more? Come on, I know you're here somewhere. There you are, he's behind me. Oh, and he's a trooper. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. You have to do a lot better than that. No, I don't need shatter. Where you at? I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. He's coming for me faster. <laughs> I love the fact that that just knocks him down. It gives me so many shot cheap shots. Another jukebox token. Gotta figure out how to actually use the jukebox. But, uh, anyway, uh, last time we finished off the amazing Black Rock Quarry, and now we're being told to head to containment, but I have been told by a good friend of mine that I need to actually check in with Ati after every story mission, because he may have a new side quest or two for me. So what we're gonna do, uh, furnished chamber, ventilation, what's the closest thing to the janitor's office? Probably ventilation. Janitor's office. Perfect. Exactly where I wanted to be. Uh, he also said that the uh, the mold mission will let me know when it's ready to continue, but until then I shouldn't worry too much about it. Takes care of those. Janitor's office. Janitor's office. Right there. Here we are. Been a while since I've been through this section, so... <laughs> that was locked originally, if I remember correctly. That's not the right way. This is... Hey, Ati. <laughs> oh, yeah, see, look, he's got two more missions for me and what it looks like. What a mess, clear the clog. Okay. And what a mess, talk to the plants. Or you can sing to them. Hey. Okay, uh, let's do the clog one first. Clear the clog. Jesse helps Ati by clearing the clog from the pump station. Alright. So the pump station... ...is not this way. It's actually an area we haven't been yet. Interesting. It's marked on my map as an area I've not been. Which, uh, to me, screams, hello. Oh, no, this is the back door out of Auntie's place. NSC power plant, no. Oh, it's on the upper level. Isn't it? It is, it must be on the upper level. Okay, we're gonna have to figure out the best way to get there. Or is this the lower level? Hmm. The, the, the downside to this map is it's always hard to tell exactly where I need to be. Hmm. The pump station, huh? It's obviously an area I haven't been. I guess I just need to try and find a sign or two that'll point me in the right direction. <laughs> uh, coolant pumps. Maybe it'll be near the coolant pumps. It is definitely not near the coolant pumps. That's like the opposite direction of the way I need to go. Oh, oh! 
Hello. Now hold up. What is my mission here? I know I've got a maintenance. Uh, hiss rangers. Okay, so nothing special. Just knock these guys out of commission. Come on. You work for me. Yep, you were a ranger. I thought you were. <laughs> you were also a ranger, if I remember correctly. Yes, you are. Good night. Good night. At least I'm getting plenty of materials. Oh. I see you, mother. Oh! Bad hiss. Hello. That was annoying. We get them. Oh, no, we did not. There's still one more, you idiots. <laughs> oh, oh, another wave. Another wave has appeared. Seriously? Get out of here. You guys are just no threat. Oh, hi. Your aim sucks. You don't do anywhere near enough damage. Oh! Hey! Late hit, good sir! Late hit! That it? Thankfully, I get my health back from these pickups real easily. Coolant pumps, that's what I want. Yeah, I remember this section. I even remember there being kind of a... No, that's the furnace chamber. Why does it say there's a second door in here? Hmm. I'll figure it out. Ah, okay, here we are. This is the way to the coolant pumps. And from here, it should get me close to the clog, because this is where the clog used to be. Hey, look, there's mold here, too. You know, because it's bad enough that we've got the frickin' clog around here, now we've got the mold. The next thing you know, the damn game's gonna throw an enemy at me that's literally just called the shit. It's just gonna be a giant pile of shit that Adi took one day and just forgot to flush. Joy. I can hear all the whisper whispering going on over here. According to this, there should be a door or something over here that leads to the pump room. I'm not seeing one down below. And I'm not seeing one up above. Unless it's way up above. Like up there, up above. Like holy shit up there. The hell? Excuse me. Clog complaint. That gross blockage down in the water systems is back. What the fuck is it? And where does it keep coming from? And why the hell does Otto keep yelling nonsense at it? He acts like he can understand him. Of course, he acts like we can understand him, too. Guess that's just his brand of crazy. I'm going to try out a new drain cleaner. Extreme strength. Dude, if, if it's... Uh... Salvador security order. Salvador, head of Bureau security. I'm making a formal security order due to the incident in April. Oh, right. I know that one. I know that one. But I did see I have a new hotline to look, listen to. And it's from the board. Astral Constructs. Hello. Certain resources loot can be constructed, crafted into mods, forms. We advocate, facilitate this at control points, menus. These will be available exclusive for the director. Huh. So, only the director can mess around with the control points. And as we learn, only Jesse can actually fast travel using these. Huh? Is this the pump station? This is the pump station. Oh, it's below us. Ah, I can't hurt it from here. 
water cooler procedures. Altered item water cooler. No unique procedures required for containment. If the item's form is different than any previously reported, then make note describing the new form. The object's true shape and appearance are unknown. It has been known to take the form of the following objects. A ring of keys, lunchbox, wrench, microscope, stapler, glasses, mail tube, and a spoon. The item is able to adopt the physical form of items in its immediate vicinity. Oh, it's a copycat. Huh. The item is capable of limited physical movement, repositioning itself whenever it changes form. This only occurs when it is unobserved physically and digitally. Because of this, the transition between shapes has never been observed. Restart reciting formula I-14 or I-32 causes the item to reveal itself by shuddering. <laughs> it doesn't like certain math formulas. The item was initially discovered within the bureau itself. Whether an agent brought it inside or it resided here prior to the bureau's arrival is unknown. I cannot go that way, and I need a cube to deal with that. I need a cube to deal with that as well. Hmm. And I cannot go that way either. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. Where do I go from? Ah, I could go up here. Again. Okay, there's only so many of these that I can use, guys. Ah. Open door, get new cube. Which is fine, because that unlocks this. This unlocks that. Which did what exactly? What did that do? Besides annoy me. Oh. Yeah, I still need this one. Mission updated, activate the draining pump. Hmm. Ah, that would be you, I would suspect. Go to the lower level and push back the clog. Oh my. Is this a boss battle? Am I walking right into a boss fight? I mean, it would not surprise me to find this sentient clog being an actual boss fight. Ugh, that's so wrong looking. Freaking ugly. Why can't I hit that? Weird. That one's gone. Goodbye, Mr. Clog. Oh, I got some ability points for that. The importance of synergy. Sweet hell. Doing side missions is gonna give me ability points. I am all for it. All right, what was the other side mission that Ati gave us? That would be... Talk to the plants. Jesse helps Ati by speaking with the plants in central research in the research section. Okay? I'm... minorly disturbed. The game wants me to talk to plants. E. Well, as long as they don't start trying to get me to kill everybody, I'm all right. All right, let's see if I can't get my ass to general research here really quick. After I deal with a couple hiss bitches. Oh, oh, you are more than a hiss bitch. Knock that off. You were a moderate level hiss bitch. <laughs> Oh, my poor energy. It needs recharging. Damn it. There we go. Can I get over here now without you guys giving me any more headaches? No! Oh, there is still somebody alive. There are multiple somebody's alive. <laughs> wow, that was big and nasty.
Okay, I believe now we're finally free and clear. Ah, three more ability points. Ooh, what trouble could I get into with these? I could bump my energy level up more, or I could crank up my launch damage more. Ooh, I think I'm gonna actually increase my base energy level. Career development, additional personal mod slot. Oh, 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 I have a third mod slot. Oh, we've got to get some use out of this. Oh, geez, what do we want? Launch efficiency, launch efficiency. There's gotta be a way to sort this. Like, I really need a way to sort this properly. Oh, hell no, launch efficiency one. Dang, no way I'm using a level one mod at this rank. 15%, that's actually pretty good right there. Turn in this board countermeasure. Kill his troopers, ooh. It's not like I don't see plenty of those around. All right, central research, central research. Uh, oh, this place always creeps me out. Talk to the plants. Well, I'm here, there are plants here. What type of plants would you like me to talk to, Ati? There are no shortage of plants in this place. That's an elevator, it's not what I'm looking for. That's just a potted plant. There is no plants in the can. At least I'm pretty sure there are no plants in the can. I'd be very odd. Be very odd if there were plants in the can. But I've seen weirder. Interesting. Luck and probability, parapsychology. So I can't actually get back up here from stairs. I have to use an elevator. Maybe he just wants the big ass plants. Ati, you were not specific about what plants I'm supposed to be talking to. Like, there's the big trees, there's the big potted plants. Talk to the plants, it says. Talk yeah, I'm working. Plants. Small talk was never really my strong suit. At least small talk was never really my strong suit. At least they can't talk back. Did, did that line just copy? I could have sworn she said that twice. Huh? Okay. I hope your day has been productive, little plant. <laughs> that really works, huh? Oh, I see. I need to find wilted plants to talk to. Oh, this is going to be a scavenger hunt, isn't it? Oh, joy. On the plus side, at least the game will tell me if I'm reasonably close to one, right? I don't expect any to be in here in the mold section. I definitely don't expect the mold mission to be up and running again. Hello? I missed a document over here. Threshold utility. Thresholds have always been sources of great inspiration and great challenge. When a new threshold manifests in the olded house by bleh, we never know what new discoveries it will provide to the Bureau, but we must always seize these opportunities. This report will examine the process of distinguishing recent threshold effects based on their utilitarian possibilities. The quarry blot, er, brought Blackrock, one of our most invaluable discoveries, but if the mold has any scientific value, it has been difficult to find due to the lengths we must go in fighting back the particularly prolific plant. These are very distinct cases and worth comparing as their study offers vastly different dangers and rewards. Huh. Interesting. I need to find more wilted plants, though. Where can I find me some wilted plants? Like, I thought I'd be talking to, like, just, like the big trees and such in here. But these guys seem pretty lively. And not much for conversation. Hello? I hope those nasty I can't believe that works as well as it does. Hello. 
Have I been in here? If I have, I obviously found everything. What about this one? Again, I must have already found... No, there was a treasure chest hiding in a stall. That's a terrible place for a treasure chest. It's gonna get filthy in there. Hmm? Oh, that's just a radio. And that is more reading material. Hi, Carla. Does it strike you as odd that Darling insists on having us appear in those bizarre videos of his? I mean, we just stand there. He doesn't even let us have lines or anything. Don't get me wrong. Beats a day in the lab. Plus, it always, plus, it's always great to work with you two. Oh yeah, I finished the comparative analysis of the two black rock samples you sent. The prism, or whatever you called it, I filed it into the usual place, under C for Carla. A handy mnemonic device, right? <laughs> anyway, let me know if there's anything you want to discuss about the data. I'll gladly explain. Maybe we could chat about it over some drinks, or dinner even. I can't remember the last time I had a good steak. Maybe we'd go together after work sometime? I'm free tomorrow. All the very best, Hubert. Aww. Oh, that was, uh, that was surprisingly sweet, all things considered. Looking for wilted potted plants in central research. Like that one. I wish my leaves were as pretty as yours. <laughs> oh my god. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Okay, I think we've made a full loop of the lowest section here. Oh, but I almost you missed you. you have a family? I have a brother. I'm looking for him right now. Oh. Doesn't help that a lot of these are in kind of like darkened areas where it's hard to see them. I've already been through that section. Central research is not exactly a small area is the pro problem. On the plus side, these all seem to be pretty much the same. I just want to double check and make sure there's not one in this shelter. Oh, have I not been in this shelter? Emergency call summary. A possible AWE in which an unnamed individual experienced transcorporeality via phone line. Event is no noticeably similar to AWE bleh, in which bleh. Event is believed to be caused by bleh, and a result following measures have been taken to prevent further bleh. Lots of it. Lots of bleh. I've not been in here, apparently. Or I would definitely have taken the treasure chest. But I still need to find two more damned plants around here. And the game is not going to make it easy. Although, at the very least, it's not dumping ass loads of hiss on me right now. Which is, honestly, it's kind of surprising. There's one. They say I'm the director, but... I have no experience <laughs> in leadership roles. I have no on-the-job training. That's the elevator. This is me leaving Central Research and heading back to the HRA lab. Not what I want. Not what I want at all. Hello, is there a plant in here who needs a Peppa talk? No, but there's a paperwork in here that needs reading. Plant complaint. Hey, so I was just wondering about the plants in research. Is it really necessary to sing to them? I mean, that janitor does have a nice voice and the plants sure seem to like it. Maybe he could just switch it up a bit? I'm getting pretty tired of the tango. <laughs> the tango. He sings the tango to them. And where did these plants even come from? No one seems to remember when they were planted. And people like them a bit too much if you ask me. Are we being invaded by house plants? Worth looking into. Gotta be honest, would not put it past anything in this place. Really, really would not. Hello. Oh. Hi there. Get the fuck out of here. The hell is this? Synchronicity. Synchronicity is a phenomenon long recognized by the wise, but only recently given a name by science. It is how we rationalize events connected by no identifiable causality, yet clearly conjoined in purpose. How does a dream foretell an event in the physical plane? Why do hounds bail at the death of their master, which has occurred miles away? The world is unified in ways we do not yet understand, and sometimes we stumble across these invisible unseen cords and wonder at the result. 
The visionary Carl Jung led, laid the road, now we must walk it. My fledgling research department will make it our mission to reliably reproduce bleh behavior by the close of 1959. Once done, the mechanics of synchronicity will lay themselves bare in due time. We are striding into the future of science. History may not remember our names, but God himself will. A uh, little full of yourself there, good sir. Okay, maybe a lot full of yourself. But on the upside, I did not find a plant. Did I say upside? I should have said downside. I want to find plant number six. Get this mission done. Where would I find plant number six? Mm -hmm. I have found plant number six! Holy! I have been interrupted by El Hisios. Bitch, please. There you go. Oh. Oh, you guys want to start something, don't you? How the hell is that not hitting him? Is that it? Our boy just suicided. And yet I'm still getting the angry music. Oh well, don't really care all that much. I found the last plant. Oh, son of a bitch, I can't talk to the plant while there's combat going on! Where? Where's that fucking hiss agent? I know I hear him. That's the worst part, is when you can hear them and you can't find them. You know they're around. And you just want to shoot the son of a bitch. But you can't seem to find them. There you are. That it? No, of course not. Oh, that sounded angry. I think there's a flyer. Oh, fudge! Holy crap, I hate those things. <laughs> oh, I was not expecting that thing to pop up there. Oh, that was instinctive reaction. Just smash the thing in the face. really brings out the green in your leaves. New bureau alert. Maintenance. All of them. But I kind of wish there were more. They're good listeners. Well, two ability points. And more importantly, a reason to head back to maintenance. It's just gonna be one of those days. Maintenance, the NSC power plant. Uh, where is the nearest point is the question. Oh, definitely not dimensional research. And probably not here in Darling's lab? Holy shit. I've been feeling questions recently regarding HRAs. What are they for? Do you always need to wear them? How did I miss... How did I miss his lab? Residence. It's there, but we can't see it. It vibrates around us, through us, from us. But what if the vibration is conscious? What could a force like that do? Bleh. Open the door to a... Bleh. I've called... Bleh. It's so useful, darling. Seriously. The bleh. I meets a force that is far beyond the forces we've previously dealt with. It has showed me so much that I have to wonder, is resonance the key element in all altered phenomenon? AWEs, altered items, objects of power, do they share a common bleh that we've yet to discover? Excuse me. We can harmonize control points. What else would the correct frequency allow us to achieve? What if resonance has been the answer this whole time? Yeah, I know that I have a new multimedia. I want to finish reading all these first. Interest. Darling budget request. Oh, Bureau Archivist. Awesome. Dear Dr. Darling, I suspect my colleague Dr. Harrington has already contacted you asking for an increase in her department's budget. I'm not surprised. Parapsychology has always been the squeaky wheel, all fuss but no results. Parakinesiology has always been the stronger department, 
more breakthroughs, more tangible data, more useful research. I'm sure a man of your esteem can plainly see which department is more deserving of the budget increase. Oh, you guys are assholes, apparently. Just think what those additional resources could do for an already formidable research team. Anyway, I know you're a fan of single malt, so I left a bottle of Will H. Brown on your deck. Oh, you're even trying to bribe Darling. Jeez, dude. Is you're any more subtle? Astral Plane. The Bureau has spent years studying why objects of power transport users into the astral plane when touched. My predecessor, Dr. Ash, theorized that a potential receptacle, determined by Jungian archetypes and the collective subconscious, would be inhabited by paranatural energies when an AWE occurred in its vicinity, creating an altered item. Over time, a link was created by the bleh and the astral plane to that item, making it an object of power. Huh. So his theory is that objects of power are altered items that have been linked to the astral plane and therefore given some degree of stability or control. So many additional theories have been raised since Dr. Ash's time. Objects of power were placed on Earth as tests by some astral entity, our dimension was once part of the astral plane, and the objects were left behind as its borders receded. The astral plane was an early threshold into the oldest house, but the connection was severed, and now the two are linked solely through objects of power, etc, etc. I will attempt to disprove some of these in order to thin the herd. Hopefully the truth will emerge. There's a lot of paperwork in Darling's lab. I already messed with that. Anything else in here? Yes, there's one more document in here. Astral Plane Counter Essay. By Emily this time. Dr. Darling is insistent that certain objects of power share a direct connection to the bleh, an entity or group of entities that we have little information on, or little that I'm allowed to access. It's probably the board. In his written reports, he states that there is a clear link between these objects of power, the bleh, the astral plane, and the oldest house itself. His work supposes these links are innate, a fact ingrained into the very bleh, of objects such as the hotline or the service weapon. But what if these particular objects were never linked to the blank, bleh, but had that connection forced upon them? Isn't it strange that no other objects of power require such direct contact with the bleh? Isn't it strange that using the service weapon or the hotline will result in grievous harm or even death if the user is not the director or at least worthy of the role? Why do we assume this involvement by the bleh is a natural fact and not something more bleh? Interesting theory there, Emily. Really interesting theory. Okay, let's uh, bug out of here really quick, and now let's listen to what Darling is actually saying on that video. HRAs. I've been fielding questions recently regarding HRAs. Dude, you look exhausted. Do you always need to wear them? And what's the deal with the Hedron resonance anyway? <laughs> I... Jeez, yeah, this is this must be really late in the story before things went to hell. Poor guys looks haggard as shit. What you may have heard, HRAs are not monitoring devices. We're not tracking your movements. We're listening to your conversations while you're wearing them. We do that regardless whether or not... Ah, <laughs> uh, nice to admit it at least. Think of them as a... Uh, as a uh, life preserver. Hmm. Only instead of water, the, the thing HRAs protect you from is... Um, classified. Oh, lovely. One day that classified not water might pour in and... You'll be glad you got a got an HRA keeping you afloat. <laughs> You're not wrong there. HRA, don't worry, it'll be uh, quick and painless. Oh, jeez. Kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah, uh, you're not. Uh, you're not kidding, are you? We're making more. Jesus. 